Well, police say two men have been arrested for crimes inside a Midtown subway station. One is charged with attempted robbery and the other for allegedly shooting at a would-be thief. All right, as Fox 5's Antoine Lewis reports, commuters are fed up with their fear of becoming crime victims. When interviewed by detectives, the NYPD says that 43-year-old John Rote stated that he opened fire inside a Midtown subway station Tuesday to stop a mugging. Strap hangers like Rocket Clayman are now making their own statements about this kind of intervention. I think guns are never the answer. I think that we need stronger gun control across the board in this country. Um, so I certainly would not be in favor of somebody firing a shot. I'm really against guns, particularly in um, the subway. Authorities say Tuesday night inside the NRW subway station at West 49th and 7th Avenue, a panhandler had opened the emergency gate and threatened to steal the purse of a woman if she didn't give him money. According to police, Roe told officers he was watching and pulled a gun out he was carrying and fired warning shots in an attempt to stop the mugging. 71-year-old Percy Palmer is supportive. But I don't think it was too much, though, because you don't know what that person has that's attacking that woman, taking kind of steal from her instead of asking her, may I have a dollar or something like that. You should call a police officer. I think, I don't think you should be carrying a gun on the subway, and it's very scary. No injuries were reported. After firing the shots, police say Rote took off, eventually being taken into custody Wednesday. Police also arrested the panhandler, whom they say is well known to them. Both the NYPD and the MTA do not condone what some are calling vigilantism. Ramon Brown agrees. Not justified at all. That's just negligent. Police say John Rote has no prior criminal history. He was arraigned Thursday afternoon on charges including criminal possession of a weapon and menacing. The judge set bail at $10,000 cash. From Midtown, Antoine Lewis, Fox 5 News.